Good morning guys, it's uh, Tim from Tim's Adventures. Um, I'm here in the unit and I'm off to uh, J Mall. It's got the immigration department there, so I have to extend my visa. It's due in five days. And uh, I thought, well, I might as well give it a go myself and see how it goes. I watched a couple of YouTube videos on it and apparently it's supposed to be really simple. You just pay the money and there you go, basically. So uh, it's only the waiting in a queue that I don't like. <laughs> That's the only issue that I have. But anyhow, I'm off to Mandawi and it's J Mall. That's where the immigration department is on the second floor. And uh, we'll see how we go. I'll see you there. All right, guys, uh, job done. This is the second floor of J Mall. And that's the immigration. It's taken about 40 minutes all up. It was quite simple, but I just don't understand some of it. Um, yeah, I got charged for an ACR card. I thought the ACR card is after three months. I'm on two months, and I, and I paid 7,240 peso for one month. So yeah, I'll, I'll find out more details on what it's all about and why I got charged the extra amount shortly anyhow all right guys back uh, yeah i will ask one of the officials here i just saw him go in to the restaurant part but um yeah we'll find out what this uh 2600 is for and i thought the fee was supposed to be around the 3000 mark but obviously not so i'll get back to you <laughs> Made it home in one piece. I got the explanation fr from the lady at the counter. What it was is the ACR card. I, I, you can't actually, with this camera, you might not be able to see it. But ACR card fee is 2,620, I think. It could be even 820. Let me put the glasses on because I can't see properly. Okay, it's 2,000... Wow, even with the glasses, I still can't tell. I think it's 800. Anyhow, that's what it is. The total fee here is 5,930, but it actually was 7,240. Okay, so valid till 10th of May. So, next extension will be six months. And hopefully it will be a business visa, which is a B2. And um, then I can um, turn around and take a trip back home. Because it's a, a multiple entry. That's the one I'm going to be getting, multiple entry. So I can go home, go, go to, back to Australia and do a month of digging and then come back again here. And hopefully everything should be good. In, in During this period of time... I have to find a, a, a girl that can do computer work and so forth and I'll get her. Anyhow, so that's about it. All right, guys, like, well, that was actually very easy. So 40 minutes inside, filled out the forms, one form, that's all. And I, yeah, I forgot to mention, you need your old visa, okay, with you. That's the only information they asked for was that. They didn't ask for anything to do with COVID, any of those things, which is great. And so it's sounding like it's nearly back to normal. Hopefully the masks come off shortly and, and then it should be good. And in the countryside, no one wears it. So no one wears them. Anyhow, um, nothing else. Easy, easy to fill out. So you don't have to go to any consultancy companies to get it done. It's easy. I, I got... It looked daunting, but um, actually it's not at all. So anyhow, anyone that wants to do it, do it yourself. Much easier and save money. All right, guys, like, share, subscribe, ring that notification bell. God bless you all. Thanks very much and bye for now.